Ugh. I was pretty worried back there. Yeah, same. Oh, you won, Kristen. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I really don't want to run out of gas here. Yeah, me neither. Oh my god, we're in a desert. Hmm. Yeah, I think so. Where do we go now? Bring out the map. Okay, first option. Rumor is there's fresh wheels and nasty creatures here. Uh, skip. It'll be risky, but there should be some fuel. There used to be a pharmacy in Beverly. Well, we have a medic, so we're gonna run out of gas. That's gonna go with gas. Alrighty then. All right. Day seven, sunset. Okay, so let's take a look at what we're seeing here. There's these lightning uh, desert zones. There's an area I need to cleanse. And there's these floating weirdos. There's a fast runner. Um, I feel like I'm going to need to back out the van to here and get out, get the gas and leave. Uh, maybe I can leave someone to clean this up also in the meantime. But we're going to have to turn it off. So then I have maybe, well, Kristen is the medic. Someone with a knife, maybe? All right. Well, she can't pick anything up, though. Here we go. June. All right, Sean. Let's back it up. That's the that's the group. All right, and turn. <gasps> Ooh. I did not know that could happen. And that kind of sucks because she's far away. Not for too long. I'm gonna save you. I'm gonna go right here. Okay, so she's got a knife, but she's gotta pick something up. Let's go. What else can I do? Well, that's the turn. Let's heal her. Good stuff. Um, I'm gonna pick up that bottle. And let's move June out of the way. I think she could. Go in the car, maybe? Yeah, let's do that. Let's turn the car off. So that's one unit of gas. Alright, well I guess that's the turn. Kill 
Evet. So it's a sequence. Let's turn the car off. Let's have her fill it up. How much is that now? Two? So I might be able to get everyone in and go. Let's see if we can pull that off. Um, yeah, because it's a little too risky with what the hell's going on. Okay. Let's turn the car on. Oh. I'm going to have to drive through that? Mm. No. What we're going to do instead... Let's have her go here. Perfect. Now we can get out of here. Let's see what happens when I run over that thing. Huh? Nothing. Cool. So weird storms that's the new thing <sighs> I don't want to run out of fuel here we're gonna have to stop by somewhere on the road oh god in the middle of the night there's things there okay so I know what is that? Okay. I might be able to get some gas there. Um, I have a feeling. Oh wow, I can go there. Really don't want to. I need to go somewhere like here. Do we have anyone with a shield? Absolutely not. Why would we? Um, okay, you go out. Search that car. Fill it up next round. Since we don't have a thing. Go out with her one square, two squares. Not much there. Hmm. <gasps> okay, psycho. At least not everything is stunned, but. Oh, she can just put it out herself? Heal her. Okay. I'm going to explore a little bit more this way. Someone had a light. This guy. Okay. Time to use it, buddy. That helps. All right, so we have a can there. Um, I feel a little better about all this now. All right. Yeah, we should check that. Who else do I have? Kirsten has only one round. 
Actually, she might be able to refill the car now. Although the car is also on fire. Or is it just smoke and light? Time will tell. I'm gonna just... You know what? Best thing to do is actually back up. I just want to see. <gasps> well, I think... Alright, so watch this. We're gonna blow this up. That'll stun everybody. that stuff get some gas very good um, I would love to be able to pick up that rock but now it's on fire and this person I think can put that stuff out did I fill up the car already yeah I got five all right so here's what we're gonna do then she's gonna go over here put out the fire so I can take the rock back in the meantime you can start getting closer she is just there and she needs to come back yeah she's just gonna come back um, okay let's figure this puzzle out so first she puts this out this guy then goes and gets the rock And then Maureen gets in the car. And then June fills up the van. <laughs> okay. Um, I guess we can even start getting in. He's gonna stay there, hopefully, to lure that monster away. Oh god, okay. No, an explosion? What's going on? Jesus. Okay, get in. We got the gas. We need to get out. Apocalypse rules, man. There we go. Have to let that go. Who can drive? Maureen. Boom! Alright, we had a clean getaway. And luckily, plenty of gas. Okay. Wow, we can go far now. That's great. So, we can search for some supplies. I think that we should. I don't really have a lot of stuff left. Medical supplies, I don't seem to need. Luckily, we have a medic. Maybe some more people. Hmm. Or we can trade for gas, but I'm gonna run out of gas if I go there. I think I'm gonna go with a supply run first. Because I'm just having to find rocks and bottles along the way. Day 8, done. Mm -mm. So we do have the exploding thing. I think we're going to have to start by pulling the van back a little bit. And turning it up. Okay, let's take a look. Car, barrel, safe. In order to break the safe, though, I'm probably going to need a stick or something. And I don't have anything like that. Well, I guess we can start by destroying that thing, because maybe not. Okay.
You're gonna put that out. June is going to inspect the car. And I think Sean. I guess Sean can start heading out. Okay. Alright, everybody's out of the car. Let's go. Alright, Jude inspects the car. And got a knife. Um, can I get out? That is not cool. June will probably get hurt next round. So let's move the medic this way. I'm going to get the bottle here. Now let's inspect that. Shield. Excellent. See what happens to her. She won't get sucked in. Oh. Well. <laughs> well, that's good. Alright, so we got a shield. I can shove that thing out. Um, I already have a rock. Can I destroy them? Kill her? Huh? Put out the fire as well. Hold on a second, let's think about this. Um, I don't know if they're gonna explode if I push them. Let's find out. That's good. They don't explode when I push them. Now, oop, I don't wanna do that. Now, Kristen can essentially go. Well, she shouldn't do. Maybe if I go... You know what, let's find out. Since they're not exploding, I should be able to kill it safely. Yeah, okay. Also, I should stop hitting escape. This is gonna make this a little bit easier now. I'm gonna pick up the bottle. Can I just kill that one now? Let me see. Excellent. I don't think I have... Yeah, like we don't have a thing to do that, huh? We don't have a thing to break the lock with. Interesting dilemma. That was interesting. Okay. Um, all right, time to heal with June. I'm just putting out fires here. This guy just needs to get in. I think we're leaving. How many people are in the car? All right, so. Oh. 
Get in everybody. Interesting, so in that level you base in this level rather, you basically get one or two things and then everything sinks in. So that's what happens in the desert. Things sink. That's interesting. That's a new new challenge for sure. Okay. So we still have pretty good gas left. And go with people or pharmacy. We don't need pharmacy. Let's see if we can get some people. <sighs> We're like, we can only take one of you. Day eight. Afternoon. Oh my god, it's a doggy. Oh, and a person. All right, well. All right, listen down. I chose you. Um, so we could do a whole thing. Let me see. Can I open? Wow, she's like, a car, I need to go. Okay. Oh. That thing revives dead things. Yeah, she's gonna get hurt, so I better start getting the medic that way already. Get out of here. I like you, dog. Kill was an option. That is crazy. Gonna keep reviving. Right, we're all about to. What does this dog have? Jojo. Sorry, Jojo. We're all gonna head out of here. Brutal. I wish there was room in the van. But there isn't. Oh, could have taken the doogie. Man. All right. It's been. Always out of gas. Try to find it on the road. <sighs> Day eight. Sunset. Holy. Okay. So we're gonna do this lane switch trick here. 
because I need to get there fast. I need to like get here. Maybe here. Yes, all right, get in. Some levels you just have to do quickly. Like this one. <laughs> just get in and get out. Drive over that stuff. Van just kind of kills it, doesn't hurt it. It's nice. I bet a truck would have been better. Um, the car is also hurt. Yeah, they're Georgia was sad. See, this is cool that they're talking about what just happened. So there's a hidden place after the blockade. That's the first. Usually after the blockade, we just go to the next level. Cool. Two shields, one healer. You get a team. It is very much like a role playing game. You have your like melee tank, the shield, and hopefully a pipe or something, which I'm missing, and then range DPS with the rocks and like stuff you gotta find. Gas station looks dangerous. Alright. Let's do it. We can't go anywhere else anyway, so. I don't know what that line is. I think that might be the minimum amount of gas I'm gonna need to get through the blockade. Day eight, night. Okay. Uh, hmm, let's figure this out. So we have a line there. I don't know, gas station is most likely in there. I definitely don't wanna be on that. Cause I bet that would hurt. So, Sean has a shield. Perfect. Next. You know what, let me undo that. What I'm gonna do is just go here and then I'm gonna try to clean that up. Okay, so apparently that's not possible. Um, Kristen, the healer, should stay in until that thing is dealt with. Uh, we have another ranged DPS. Let's bring Maureen out. All right. And Lucinda has a light. And she's got... She's got a few other things. She's got... Well, we'll figure it out later. Those two things. Um, I'm gonna keep her in there this round. Whoa. That's new. I'm just gonna can just shut that and keep it at bay. Let's clear that stuff so it doesn't hurt us. Now I can bring the light out. Okay, there's a gas tank right there. And a dumpster. Let's get near that thing. So we can probably put Kristen out and let's have her. Yeah. 
Oh, okay. So that's the... Hmm, we don't want to stand there because something is going to happen there. Okay. Well, that they tell you. Let's go pick up the beer bottle then. Okay. Next round. Filled up. See if we can siphon some gas. Um, can I do it from this side? I'm gonna find out. All right. Really? the rock we can probably destroy and stun people real quick give me an extra round Siphon some gas first. I think we should stay there. Okay. round. Kristen, I guess she can just get in. Okay, next round. Hmm. Okay, so I have a rock throw it at that but I think I need to back up first interesting let's see if I can make it nice nice all right let's fill it up and get in First, you get in. Get in. And then we can have Kristen drive. Okay. 
Okay. So that was a, I think, pretty good demonstration of how to use the the mines, the floating spheres, just destroying them in time, stunning and exploding the ones around it. You can actually move them around safely; they don't attack you. So that's nice. And I don't know if there's a secret place. Let's just do the blockade. I think it's time. Here we go. The desert blockade. Day nine, done. Okay. <laughs> Let's take a look at the obstacle. I can blow them up. I, uh, I'll lose all the stuns out. But I'm going to need to essentially obviously go from this lane. In order to do that, first I need to get one of my shields out. So that's going to be Sean. Actually, let me see if I can pull them out here and then shove the monster away. I think it's going to happen. Well, it just collapsed. So far, so good. Now we're gonna have to deal with that guy too. Maybe we can throw a rock at him and see what happens then. So that's what happens when they die. <laughs> okay. Um, hey, that's good to know. I'm going to have to... Interesting. Do I have a ranged weapon? No, I don't. Somebody's going to need to get that bottle, throw it at that thing to stun everything. Maureen is about to get hurt, so Kristen's going to need to get ready to heal her. And Sean can't do anything, has to wait. That's it. And turn. They're attacking each other too. Well, that's nice. Okay. So, next round. See if I can heal her now. Nope. Oh my god. It's really hard to move here. Okay. See my turn actually right now. Yeah, alright. So they kind of did. What I was afraid of happening, but we still have one more bomb. I'm going to move her into place. I might be able to. I still can't get to her to heal her. Maybe if she moves here. Okay, and she's the person who puts the fires out. So that cleared out that whole area. Now, essentially, once the fires are out, I can go. But in the meantime, Sean doesn't have a weapon. Okay. Let's see what we can do. Maureen could start heading towards some of the fires here. Okay, and turn. And 
going to run out of time very quickly here. I just need to turn off, uh, turn off, put out this fire. I can't believe she can do that with her bare hands. Um, I'm just gonna be ready with that. Let's get in. has to be it. Now the car is already breaking. And if I run over that thing, it might be a problem. And I can't move it. And currently I can't really shove it either. However, I might be able to kill it. Stay there to survive and turn. Oh my god. Okay. Everybody get in. This is like her jumping in. Yes. And then, you know what? That looks like a big bump. Well, they're both big bumps. Escape. Yes. All right. That's the desert. Cool. So that was interesting. Now we're in the basin. Ooh. This place looks messed up. <laughs> <laughs> 